mask, you do this prawn and chorizo. You're cooking for people, everything's got to be done right. As long as things are done properly, then you're minimising the risks of anything. Luckily, these guys, they all know what they're doing, so it makes my life a lot easier. So all of our temperatures have to be between a certain amount. So all of our fridges and freezers, our freezers have to be below minus 18. So that's fine, that's minus 21. These are the auto cams. We cook our meat through here. Uh, cook cycle. The meat's got to be over 65 degrees for it to go out. So at the moment that's probing 68, so that's all good. It's not just temperature checks we have to do now. We have to keep up today with our cleaning schedules, uh, calibration of probes, which is our cream ones. Temperatures have to be anything above 65 degrees for hot holding and 75 for anything cooked fresh. I wouldn't say it was an easy job at all. It's very hard work, but it is very enjoyable. There's always, there's always something new to learn working for Harvester. It literally, like the first five hours, on a, especially on a Sunday when we're, it's our busiest day, where it just flies. It doesn't feel like you've been here at all. Best part of the job, it's got to be the staff. You get on with all the staff, it's real good man. Interesting. Interesting, Toby. It's quite enjoyable. There you go, then. All right, the place is tad warm. Please be careful. Tower 25 away, that's Lee. I enjoy my job. I like getting up the morning. I enjoy coming to work for the company that I work for. They pay my wage um, and they're helpful, which always makes the job a lot easier. Maintain the relationship with the front face. It's organisation, communication. If you can communicate with your front house staff, your job's a lot easier. As a company, definitely one of the better ones that I've worked for without a doubt. They're quite keen on you getting a bit of time to yourself as well, so you're not always working. The retention level is better for people, and I think it's just a fairer way of working with people, so it definitely works anyway. We've got two fish on, Dave. I've worked in the kitchen since I was 15, and this has been by far the best place that I've worked at, easily. I have a real passion and a real drive. Um, and I really love to learn, and that's something that Mitch and Butler has really supported me through. Yes, I am young, but they recognise the fact that I want to learn and they've, they've put me forward. I've done so many different courses, it's, it's been a really good journey so far, and I just I can't wait to really continue on it. Finch, can I get one small off you, please? In my point of view, it's really good. I, I came on board as a junior sous chef, and in the space of three months, I was promoted to my first chef shop, which I'm currently in now here. You know, management here are quite pushing to get you to do all your certificates, to finish all your courses. m and there if you want them to be. You know, if, what, if you want it, it's there. Just go out and get it, really. <laughs>